What's up guys, Vulcan Trader here. Today we got a sweet deal for you. Many awesome uh, bonuses in this video if you watch all the way through. So um, I'm gonna show you how to buy one ounce of gold, this one right here, below spot price, so significantly below spot price. So if you uh, like stuff like this, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you get more awesome videos like this. Okay, so to get started, there's multiple things we're gonna compound before we buy this. Um, so there's something called uh, eBay Bucks. Um, eBay Bucks is a just eBay program and they usually give like 1% in eBay Bucks, but they run specials every now and then where you get eight, 10 or 12%. So um, to get this, first you have to sign up for the eBay Bucks. You just um, I'll maybe put a link to this, but I got a bunch of other links I got to add. But anyway, you Google this, you'll find it. Sign up for eBay Bucks, okay? And then whenever they run these, uh, and then the second thing you need to do is on your account, um, do notifications. It's under, should go back here to my eBay communication preferences. And then scroll all the way to the bottom, promotions and surveys, show, and then general email promotions. Check that and save. And then you'll end up getting emails like this every so often where they um, tell you that you can get eBay bucks. You just activate that and right now I can get it for two days. I can get 8% eBay bucks on specific items. And they have certain terms um, that would keep you from getting this on most uh, gold and silver. But the um, if you read it, basically it says it excludes bullion, but you can get it on uh, pre-1933 or vintage type coins. So that's one way to get around it. We're going to show you that. And then the other limitations are you can get uh, $100 in rewards per transaction at, capped out at $500 in rewards, um, I guess, per promotional period that they do it whenever you get those emails. And... So first we're gonna get 8% uh, cash back with that, and then we're gonna use a credit card that gets 5% on PayPal, and you so you're gonna use PayPal when you check out with eBay you, with this credit card attached to your PayPal account, and that will give you another 5% cash back on the Chase Freedom card. And there's other cards like this that give you um, rotating categories, um, throughout different quarters, like Discover IT will sometimes do a similar one on eBay and PayPal, and then eBay as a card, but it'll say it gives you 5%, but it would depend on, based on what the points are worth, it's actually only 3%, but it, you know, it's still something if you couldn't find 5%. Anyway, and then um, you can only get up to $1,500 um, cash back per quarter, and one ounce of gold is about 1460 or something at the moment, so we're just gonna buy one, and then we'd max it out. If you wanted to buy two, uh, you could do that. Say you had a spouse, then you could have one credit card in your name, one credit card in their name, and then you could buy you two ounces of gold up to three thousand dollars, get the full five percent cash back on that. And um, I get a sign up bonus uh, link for you right here. And if you sign up for the Chase Freedom card, then you can get a uh, two hundred dollars cash back uh, right now. If you meet the, if you only spend. $500 in purchase, which I mean, huge right there. It's an amazing sign up bonus for a small amount spent. So I'll add that in the uh, description. So you can get that plus your 5% cash back on your gold. And then our third thing we're going to do, I haven't tried this before, but I, um, did going to do it on this. And basically you, uh, this is one of those referral websites. So you basically just go to topcashback.com search for eBay up here, get eBay 1.5% cash back, and then get cash back now, and then it'll end up redirecting you to the eBay website. Okay, continue. And then now whenever you buy it, it should give us uh, another 1.5% cash back on that. And I'm gonna add a, I also got a referral link for this one. You'll get a $15 Amazon gift card apparently if you sign up for this, I'll add that link in there too. Then what we need to do is um, find us a gold coin that qualifies that's not bullion. And how you do that, um, there's a website and we're gonna find uh, melt values for gold coins. So. Um, search for this Mount Value Gold Coin, and I always use this one NGCC Coin. And we scroll down here. Basically, anything that's the date range on is pre 1933, and 
I found that the um, basically the two that you always want to buy are these ones right here, the Liberty Head uh, twenty dollar and the Saint Gaudens twenty dollar. They're all pre nineteen thirty three. Don't count as bullion and. The reason they work out better, so you're only getting a hundred dollars cash back, which isn't actually up to eight percent, but it, I mean, it's still, I mean, um, gonna be better. We'll show you. I'll show you in a while in a second. So, I'm gonna, yeah, basically these uh, like the ten dollar ones, they mark them up so much that even if you get a full eight percent off the um, the price or the five dollars even or even worse, the basically the larger the coin, the closer the the pr price of that is to the spot price. So whenever you take the um, hundred dollars off, even though it's not actually equaling eight percent, it ends up being a better deal and gets you b lower below spot price than one of the ten or the five dollars. You can do the math on it or try and find some other ones that are, are these that maybe are closer to spot before you subtract out the eight percent. But um, I found that pretty much these always and just getting the straight hundred dollars works the best. So I end up searching for those and like these down here don't work because uh, these are all, um, they're too new so they count as bullion I believe. So anyway, now that we, um, so I would search and then just do uh, like double eagle is a, is a good one. So I do good double eagle, pre-1933. I'm gonna find one right here. You know, search for one of the big dealers like Bay Precious Metals is one, Atmex, JM Bullion, SD Bullion, Liberty, all these. You, you can search and see if they have their own separate website, but buying off of eBay for, from them is uh, ends up being cheaper, especially doing all this stuff. So we got a yeah, here eighteen seventy six twenty dollar gold Liberty double head. This is probably not the cheapest one. I think I already found the cheapest one. So, but this is how I'm showing you how you would search for it to find the right one. So search for double eagle gold, and then we want this category. And we want it to basically we don't want any word of bullying up here in the category, so it won't disqualify it from getting the hundred dollar eBay bucks. So we're now pre nineteen thirty three, and the price of gold right now is like fourteen sixty two, and then we saw the melt value of these is fourteen thirteen, so we'll do like. 1465 uh, we're gonna, so do uh, so we got pre 1933 double eagle now that the pre 1933 is right here showing up since we clicked on it and then we go to let's see how many hits do we get on that two, it's still at 2000 oh we want only buy it now and we're gonna do the problem is you get these other uh, not many right here actually, but you'll get the t these ten and five dollar ones that they'll try and sell for the price of the twenties. So we're gonna go down here. Oh, uh, more filter. Go to price. And then do price from fourteen hundred to like fourteen sixty five, and then I'll get us one that are cheaper. Again, this one's the only one that falls in that price range, but it is a twenty dollar double eagle for fourteen fifty five, which you notice is uh, about forty bucks over this um, the the melt value price. But then, yeah, you'd want to buy this one. Basically, you'll see you'll get one hundred dollars in eBay bucks, so fourteen fifty five. Our spot price. These are the reason they're a little bit. The spot price of gold is fourteen sixty, but then these are. 0.96 ounces it's not a full one ounce and then they're 90 percent gold they're they've got like another alloy in them or something so anyway that's why they're you know 50 bucks less than the um a full ounce of pure gold just so you understand that and then it's 1455 which is their markup value that the dealers are trying to sell you it's only 39.99 over milk per coin so you go right here and do we do 1455.54 I don't know if that top cash back will work. It may or may not. So, um, I haven't tried it before, so I'm not going to add that. But we'll just do times 0.95 for the uh, Chase Freedom card. And then, so that's 1382. So we're already below the melt value at this point. And then minus another 100. The melt value of 1413. So we're, we're getting it for $1,282. And minus another 200 if you sign up for the Chase Freedom card, maybe get it in time and uh, purchase this before the end of the year um, so yeah you get it way below the spot price of 1413 
and just make sure that whenever you um yeah, and so you know that you're getting it right here. See, hundred dollars in eBay bucks, it'll tell you. So if it was, it didn't qualify. It was bullion. It would show that there. And yeah, so you just uh, already bought one, but anyway, you just add it to your cart, buy it. I don't want to um, go in here and see like the last four of my card numbers or anything like that. But um, yeah, just make sure you use PayPal, not a not a credit card outside of PayPal, and use the you know Chase Freedom card attached to PayPal. And then um, these extra hundred dollars you'll get. What you want to do with these is um, say go, you go buy one of these, uh, maybe one uh, one tenth of an ounce gold eagle. Say after you buy, you know do this a couple times, you get two hundred dollars in eBay bucks in there. Then you go buy one of these, find a good deal, and the uh, scroll down here that like this is a good one, maybe right here. You just find or just any you know small gold coin or something that is closest to melt values you can find but it's free money at this point that you got on these uh, eBay bucks that you can use to buy some extra gold to do something with those and I think that's it um, yeah so like subscribe hit the bell and go sign up for that stuff and uh, get you some good deals